Good evening once again. This is Prime Edition. Now, the memorial service for 21 children who perished in the fire tragedy at Hillside and Arash Academy will be held Thursday amidst lingering questions on the status of investigations and to the cause of the fire. Nine of the bodies will be interred immediately after the interdenominational service, expected to conclude by mid-morning. At the Muega Stadium in Kini, Nyeri County, Preparations for the interdenominational memorial service for the 21 children who died at the ill-fated dormitory in Hillside and the Russia Academy are in the final stage. The committee planning for the final rights for the victims of a fire are on an inspection tour of the grounds with the national government having pumped about 3 million shillings into the preparations. Nyeri Governor Mutahika Higa, who co-chairs the committee, says the event will begin early to allow nine families to inter their loved ones. Uh, the rest would have to be taken back to Narumoro uh, because ten will be buried on Friday and then another two, will, the, le the remaining two will be buried on Saturday. And so that is how we will conduct um, the, the requirements for all of them. Deputy President Rigadi Gashago will be among the mourners with families having requested that the service be free of politics. Uh, well, tomorrow we will have a very short service that will begin at 8.30 and then we are praying that by 11 we will have, gone, we will have uh, finished the program. Preparations to reopen the school immediately after the burial of the victims of a fire are also in top gear. Once we are through with this, it is important that I mention we have 143 boys who have to go back to school and begin life afresh. We already have organized a dignity package for them. We will step in and uh, make sure they are, they are able to start off. Questions, however, abound on the status of investigations into the course of a fire, with the Directorate of Criminal Investigations still combing through available evidence for clues on what transpired on the fateful night. That is something that the DCI can handle, and the latest, I think, is that they are still doing investigation and almost are at the tail end of what happened. John Jacob Curia, Prime Edition.